how red we are making a piggy bank in the shape of a cross. As you can tell, I have an image printer right here. This is actually going to be uh, the one side that's kind of decorated. Hope y'all like it. If not, then I don't like you either. I'm just kidding. So, I guess what I'm going to do is take my hot glue gun and put some hot glue on the back. Like an outline? Yes, like an outline. Well, earlier you said we, and maybe a viewer wondering who we. Do you ever think of that? I think they'll be fine. With me today, I have my sister. I need another hot glue stick. Wow. This green. time I have a green hot glue stick. Colored with a Sharpie. Because I was bored yesterday. So. Be safe, kids. Make sure you have an adult with you when you're using a hot glue gun. Unlike me. Exactly. Except I've been using a hot glue gun for over three years now. So. Where did you get the ring from? Which one? That one. That one I got from my best friend and that one I got from my mother. Yeah. Because who doesn't love their mother? Yeah. And now... The image is glued. I'm going to give that a quick second to dry. And now I have my handy dandy sharp object. Make Actually make sure to have an adult with you for this. Yes. Have, let your adult do this. Cut the out the design for you if you want to put your own kind of design. I will have a link in the description for... This design, though, if you would like to use this one instead. But make your own. You can doodle on it. It doesn't matter. You can always just make your own if you want. But let's cut this out. Oh, my glue's not dry yet. Whatever. Okay, let's give that a quick minute to cool down. Okay, now that it has dried a little bit more, now let's finish cutting. I do have scissors. I was thinking about trying to use my scissors to cut this. Most of the time, my scissors irritate me when I'm trying to cut something. Cut out this one section. Mm -hmm. You know what? Instead of wasting y'all's time, how about we do a bit of a time lapse here?
Okay, now that we have our design cut out, glue it a little more. I'm gonna glue it a little bit more. Yep. Is this whole part lifted up? Mm. No, I don't think that. Okay. Hot glue gun has heated up a little bit more. Now let's put it down. I'm fine. Kind of got a little bit of hot glue on my finger, though, which pretty much doesn't kill me. I'm fine. I've been burned a whole lot worse than that. Now that that is done. Are we going to like, let it dry a little bit? Or like, uh... I'm going to take my Sharpie and trace this design. Before I do that, I better fix that one side right here. Uh oh. Got some extra sticking off of it. Now that that is fixed. Wait, didn't you like hot glue it down with the leaves? Mm. I usually hate it when I do that because it just moves on me. That's why you have to know exactly what you're doing. No, I never know what I'm doing. I've just had a lot of years of practice. Like I love... I just love doing DIYs, and so I decided why not make a channel to share my DIYs with the world. Now, let's do another time lapse of where we cut this out. Now that we have both of these cut out, you're probably wondering how I'm going to put these together. Same. Actually, that is why 
I have these two strips right here. They were pre-cut before we started. Yes, they were. They came off of an old shoe box. Because who t doesn't have a shoe box laying around their house, right? <laughs> just go buy, just wait until you get a fresh, need a fresh new pair of shoes. When you buy them, just take your cardboard shoe box and cut it up. Yeah. It doesn't have to be a specific color, just get one. I mean, if you want to use it, you can So I think what I'm just going to do is take the hot glue gun and kind of just like wrap it around. Or... Are you sure it'll be long enough? Yes. I think I'll do it like that instead. Across the edge of it right here. Um, I was just trying to like get a good angle of that. That way it can just like fold all the way around. It probably won't have enough, uh, enough of a thin strip of cardboard for that. Like, don't we have more? I have, yeah, I have more. second. Let's take this, wrap it back around. And then push it in place like so. Take the hot glue. Whoa, that came out a little fast. Glue that down. And quickly grab another hot glue stick. Or two. Okay. And then I'm gonna bend this back like that. It allows the uh, cross to have more of like a curve as you do it. Yeah. But then for this part, I'm probably, I'm gonna have to, whoa, that thing came undone. But I thing. do have a question. Hmm. How does it turn into a piggy bank? You literally just cut a hole in the top. Oh. Okay. Okay, crap. Hold on, this hot glue is not drying. Let's give it a second to dry. As you can tell, while I let the hot glue gun, or the hot glue on this cool down a little bit, I cleaned off my desk. I threw all of that in the trash. Into the trash bag. Let's get this folded. Take this hot glue and just go straight along this whole siding right here. Is the glue turning like green? No. Oh man. How long does it take?
Okay. Uh, yeah. Thought I might be wasting y'all's time just going around the whole thing really, really slowly. But I think I'm just gonna attach this part and then just call it a day. Right? Sounds like a plan. Still kind of questioning how I'm gonna do it though. I could tape it, glue it, anything. I think taping it would just be easier though. Because with taping it down, you'd always be able to kind of just cut the tape a little bit just to be able to take off the back and take out all your money. Dude, we should have done this in the first place. Just put tape on it. No. I prefer not to waste my tape because this is all the tape I have. This one roll. He went over to me the fast there. Instead of waiting like 20 minutes for us to do this. You're fine. We were wasting our 20 minutes of our life. No. If you can't handle waiting that long, Olivia, then you will never be able to handle making your own, making a DIY project. Your chair makes a lot of noise. Yes, it does. Stop moving in the chair. Tape does me no good when it's folded up and won't come undone. Unfolded, should I say. I think I should probably just end the video here, y'all. And then tape this up on my own time and stop wasting y'all's. Oh, okay. So. Before I end the video, take I'm gonna take this one side and just knead it. Whoa. Okay. I'm gonna glue that side down. That's probably the only part that I'm gluing down. <laughs> You're so weird. Don't ask why he is. He was just this. Okay, we're gonna quickly give that a minute to dry. Okay, that should pretty much be dry, but what you're gonna do, I'm doing it up on the top above the eye. Just cut out. A bit of a slit like this, and then repeat that same slit. Sorry, y'all. You all. That's all you do. Just cut the slit right up here. And then that's how you'll put in your money. Okay. Well, now don't forget to like and subscribe. And have a good day. See y'all.